Hi, this is Claire again. The cards are shuffled. I will do another reading with you. This time with a different, uh, a different spread of cards. Um, it is a spread of cards that goes to the point. You will see this. Uh, and let's assume as question that we have somebody who has a job interview and he wants to know if his chances are good. So we start and we pick six cards. And we pick them. Three in one row. Two in the next and one in the last row. I will arrange them so that the camera gets them. Them all. I hope the camera gets them all. Ah, <laughs> this is a bit difficult. I'm still a beginner with this, but I will show you everything. You will see it. Okay. So uh, this spread is very easy to tell. Uh, the meanings uh, there are not this card means this, this card means that, or things like that. This is one of my own spreads, and it is um, the first row is uh, the uh, the past and sometimes also the influence for now. This is uh, now, and this is the future, um, but not only the future, is it, it is also the outcome of everything. So, this is like it goes everything goes to this card. This is the sum, it sums it up, yeah. Okay, so let's start. And here we have in the first row, I p do the cards a little bit nearer so you can see them. Um, we have here the clover, we have the women, and we have the flowers. And the clover is a card that indicates a small luck. Sometimes it is not so good because it is too small for something, but here it means little luck, chance, everything will turn out good. Now, here, it can also indicate uh, his um, that he got the invitation to the job interview because the flowers are a, an invitation card and if we were in real life, we had to ask the man if, the, for example, the letter or the email for the job interview came from a woman or if he will be interviewed by a woman. This would be very likely when we have a woman card this central. Yeah, or maybe it also could be... A, for example, that um, that his wife or his girlfriend has told him, do this there, uh, write a letter to this company or things like that. Yeah, uh, in real life, you could ask your your querent and he uh, could tell you about it. Because when a when a person card shows up, it always has something to do with the person. Yes, and here we have. Um, I do them a little bit higher so you can see them. Here we have uh, the birds, and uh, in some decks they are the owls. Yeah, this is the same. And uh, the birds are always nervousness. Oh, he is so busy. He is so, um, so much, how you call it, when you are very uh, stirred up in your inner feelings. Yeah, nervous and things like that. And this beer, this is a, this is a. Um, his boss, his new boss that he would have. And he comes very nervous to him. And uh, the birds also indicate that the situation is nervous, like it is not calm when the interview is there. Or uh, the boss has something very different in mind. He doesn't listen to him really. Or things like that, yeah? The situation is not balanced when he has his job interview. So it is very, very uh, important what this card shows. Because this is just a description of the situation. It is not the outcome. Yes, and here we have the fox. We had him already in the first reading. The fox means something is wrong. This can mean very many things. It is not very concrete here in the cards. But we always have to stick to what the cards say. We, don't, uh, we can't make anything up. Yeah, And the fox here, I would uh, interpret him as uh, something is wrong with the whole job. He should better take a look for another company. Maybe they are, uh, they are um, making their, their employees overworked or things like that. They are burning them out. Maybe they don't pay. Uh, maybe there is something uh, they have in mind with him that uh, they want to trick him in any way. This card uh, is a warning card and this card means Yes, you can go to the job interview, maybe to make this uh, experience or to learn. Um, everybody is very nervous in a job interview, so it can be good that you have a little bit experience with that, maybe for the next job interview. But he should not trust this company. There is something wrong with them. Yeah. 
So this was this reading and in the next time we will see different spreads. I will go with you maybe also through a grand tableau. I don't know how to film this yet, but maybe I will get it and then we can start. <laughs>